We always like to bring the show and talk about our children, okay, because it's very, very important. So for years, we have seen the resilience of children. We should probably be more like our children. Think about this. Even when their schools have been targeted by gun violence and their lives have been torn apart, kids have the amazing ability to bounce back, to kind of find a smile, to find a new way of life, and to do that, and also to hold on and to hold on for love. And this next story, it is definitely a beautiful one. Jasmine Monroe shares the story of a mother who organized the first Black Lives Matter toddler march. It's viral videos like this that have been sweeping social media. I definitely always feel like it's important for kids to get involved with such uh, incredible movements like this. The late great Whitney Houston once said, I believe the children are the future. Teach them well and let them lead the way. Show them all the beauty they possess inside. And that's exactly what 26-year-old Cleveland native Narkeesh Jordan did when she organized the Black Lives Matter toddler march. A lot of parents want to go out and protest, but we can't really feel safe taking our children. And I also thought it was a great way for children to just come out and express themselves. I'm trying to educate Leo as much as possible. Little ones expressing themselves with signs and balloons all while marching through Euclid Creek Reservation. I made this sign because my future does matter. I need a future. I hope people take away that black people stop getting arrested. Parents took a back seat while the kids led the movement. There's still less than two, but we're but we're talking a lot about what kind of messages, what kind of books we can have in the house to make sure that from a really young age we're teaching them to be anti-racist and teaching them, you know, Black Lives Matter. A message loud and clear from the future history makers that there is hope and light at the end of the tunnel. Black Lives Matter. Black Lives Matter. Black Lives Matter. Reporting from Cleveland, I'm Jasmine Monroe, 3 News.